there were a couple of reasons that I couldn't use in-ear monitors before. Um, firstly, personally, for, m for myself, it was that feeling of being completely disconnected from the other musicians on, on the stage. So uh, being isolated with a, with a, with a set of uh, in-ears and not being able to hear the off microphone cues and, and things like that was, it, it was just problematic. It wasn't, it wasn't going to work. Secondly, um, the artist I worked with was not keen uh, on me having in-ears uh, for maybe for the look of them or for that perception that, that he also had of, of me being disconnected. And ACS approached me about uh, using a set of vented in-ear monitors. It was, a, it was a prospect that was very exciting. A great sound, a sensible volume and also be able to communicate with my bandmates on the stage uh, as I would without having any hearing protection or without having any in-ear monitoring. Literally the first time I, I, I tried them it was an absolute game changer. Instantly I knew that this, this is exactly what I've been looking for. These ACS monitors here that, that I've got there, they're silicon, soft silicon, um, which, is, which is really nice. So they're extremely comfortable to wear and they, they are molded, custom molded for my, for my ears. The game changer for me on, on, on these products is the, uh, is, the, is the ambient vent, the filter, on stage with my acoustic drums. I get the acoustic vibe of my drums through here. I don't have to have anywhere near as much through my monitor as I was having before. And the all important off microphone on stage communication with my bandmates is there. And even when I, when I have them in, when we're on stage, when we're, when we're sound checking, uh, walking backwards and forwards to the dressing room, whatever it is, I often forget I've got them in because uh, when they're in place in my ears I can still communicate normally and hear what's going on around me um, as, if I, as if, I, if I wasn't wearing them. And with all the wedges on stage it's much louder for me in the venue. That's why I like uh, in-ears, otherwise this is for me more complicated to do in-ears from the front of house mixing desk because normally I should have to run uh, ambience microphones but uh, for me at the moment since three months I guess uh, it's very easy. As musicians we spend a lot of time and effort working on training our hands or playing scales or playing rudiments around the drums and you know significant investment there and uh, we need to invest and think about just as much uh, uh, our ears and uh, do that from the start too whether it's you know playing when you're sit sitting practicing at home on, on the drums uh, on an acoustic drum set with some earplugs or if you're if you have e-drums um, getting a, a decent set of, of moulded in-ear monitors that you can use when you practice, that you can use live on the stage. It, it needs as much thought and as much investment as your technique, as your drum set, as your cymbals. It should be as important as the rest of your setup. So if you're serious about sound and serious about looking after your greatest asset as a musician, which is your, your ears, uh, ACS, they, they've got it covered, they've got your back and they've got the products that you need to look after these. Mm -hmm.